Go. Yes, go, go Hexa. Hexa. Go, go Hexa. Hexa. Go Hexa. <laughs> this little six-legged robot creature thing might have crawled out of a terrifying nightmare, but I'm going to show you how easily Hexa crawls into your heart. Not literally, although I'm sure she could be programmed to do that. Hexa is a six-legged robot. It has an HD camera, an infrared sensor, a distance measuring sensor, an accelerometer, and a heart of pure gold. Still she can dance better than I can. I know, right? Look! What she dance move? so excited to be a robot! <laughs> I kind of felt like it was like almost like a meeting call a little bit. This, this dance yeah. moved more than the others. Hexa uses these various tools to avoid objects, see in the dark, and give a live view of what it's looking at as it walks around the room. Okay, it's kind of like... Driving a car. Oh, okay, this is her. Hexa uses these skills to perform tasks which are created by developers. We are not developers, so we just stuck with the ones that were on Hexa's skill store. Turn Hexa over on its back. Upside okay. down or something? Uh, turn me over? Yeah. yeah. Okay, oh. like that. Is it gonna turn over? And then you press start. Oh, oh. no! Oh, okay, yeah. Wow. I'm like, really yeah, scared. Okay, yeah, that's really hurting to watch. Yeah. I put her over, put her over. It literally says when you turn over the hexa, its legs will shake and tell you I'm dying. That's yeah. kind of intense. So you'll see that she's like turning her head. Hexa. She's trying to find red right now. <laughs> no, don't do it. Don't she's wait for, for me. Something. She's gonna go after me. <laughs> oh, Kaya, she wants you. Hi. Oh, no, bud. Hexa, hexa over here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Hexa's gone rogue. This one is called Fire Marshal Rob. She'll take pictures as she walks around the room. Oh, fun. Great. Well, it's supposed to be if she sees a fire. Oh, she found oh hi, Kai. She got the red, got finally. The red. <laughs> I feel like she's something my leg and I don't like She's it. taking Should we walk her around the room? <laughs> oh, no, don't. No, 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 no. Don't, don't put it over here. I don't think I like it. Wait, I want it to be like a dog. I want it to like pop I know, right? Yeah. If it, if it said, like, um, googly eyes? Is it good? Uh -oh. It's a, like... It says, no, 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 no. This does that? not bring me comfort. Now, with all this cool stuff, I had to ask myself, why? Why spend almost $1,000 on a robot? As much as I love playing around with it, it's not really a toy. It was designed for researchers and coders as well as robot enthusiasts. I mean, I guess I'm a robot enthusiast, but I'm not a developer or, or a coder. And I don't have $1,000. All of Hex's programming is open source, so they really want people to explore what can be done with a six-legged robot, including search and rescue, because Hexa can get into all those tight spaces, and a lot of other things, too. It's like a shift and a stomp, right? Like, yeah. Like, okay, so there's like, a tilt. Yeah, Stop. 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 So as just a regular consumer, their interface can be a little bit buggy, especially with the Android app. She got disconnected. Uh, Take a quick nap. Purple light means... Help me. Setting up connections. You're still setting up connections? But the Hexa team told me that they're constantly working on updating their software. She's we bonded. Yeah. We connected. We did stuff. It's great. Like, it was fun, but $900? I don't know. I think it's super cool that she can see color and can like, take pictures and walk around and sense things and see things. If that could kind of be like, like the whole picture thing, it's actually kind of fun. I feel like with like a group of friends, if you're like, I don't know, in like a situation, a social thing, like that could be really funny and cool. Look, like I said, I'm not a coder, but the team around Hexa still made it so fun to play around with it. You can't really see this being a viable option for a regular home user. It's not a smart assistant. But again, that's not really what it's for. Hexa is more for research and development. And if you compare Hexa's price to some others in that realm, Hexa's actually a pretty good deal. I think the best way to express how much we all love this product is to say how devastated we'll be when we have to ship it back. Very devastated. Here you go. Where you go?